Hello everyone, my name is Noah, and welcome back to 7 Days to Die, Alpha 16, Season 2. Now, on my way to the traders and everything, well, I came across something big. I found another trader. Apparently, it was just right here, right beside the town. So, apparently, uh, I guess I just missed this, but it was pretty well hidden since it's, uh, right in here. But, uh, here's another trader. And I'll get to see what he has. It's also a nice one, too. So, Trader Huge, I believe. Let's see what you got. Hey, be quick about your business. Okay. Forged iron, hunting rifle, iron gloves. I really already have those. He's got 140 gunpowder. Not really anything decent. He's got a motion sensor right there. But it's pretty expensive. Doesn't seem to have anything. All right, so I'll give you these, and I'll give you these, and that looks to be everything I want to sell. So I'll buy your gunpowder. Well, I'm freezing somehow. This is all the same, so I just want to see if it will eventually go lower. Okay, no, it didn't. Alright, resources. Give me all your forged iron. 7,000, that'll cost me all my money. Uh, give me, uh, 25. Was there something else? Uh, he's kind of creepy. Well, right now, I'm just gonna go through your... cupboards and see if I can find anything. There's a wrench, that's free scrap. Now, can I reach that gun safe? I can, but if there's nothing in it. He's got a forge right there. Doesn't look like anything outside. He does have a well, and I do want to see what's down in there. He's got, like, a really nice, uh, area. Okay. Scrap. What's in the cardboard box? One dollar. Duffel bag. More scrap. I am happy with that. Now, I am a little certain that he might have a munitions crate. I thought he had one. I couldn't remember if this trader did or not. Gonna have to make it quick because uh, I'm freezing. He's got a deer slug. That's just worth selling to him. There's his cement mixer. Ticket. Mm, are you a customer? He doesn't look to, too like a concerned that I'm a customer. Looking for something special? Well, it looks like he's uh, nicer than the other ones. Nicer than Jimmy. I know, I know, I'm freezing. I'm just going around his stuff. Hey, don't come in here unzipped. <laughs> okay, thanks for the info. I'm leaving now. Not, I'm just trying to find your good stuff. Anything in here? I haven't really explored this trader and just trying to see what he has. But it's always worth checking. He's got like a whole base set up. Alright, so yeah, nothing in here. Time to see what's outside this door. Another musician's crate. So he's got two. That's really helpful. And it's another deer slug. This one deer slug is not really anything. Now, he does have a well that I do want to go into, because I believe you can go into the well. I'll close the door behind me, because I'm a nice person. And let's see what he's got down here. Pick up two mushrooms. One in chest. Easy money. 
Here's the chem station. It's like kind of glitching right there. Cardboard box. Another candy tin. And here's the entrance to his shop. Working stiff. Hard metal. Just worth the scrap. But a nice amount of uh, stuff down here. But where is the... Uh, there's another board. There's the workbench. Destroyed. I think I'll go after that hoard. I just want to sell that stuff really quickly. A nickel ain't worth a dime anymore. <laughs> That's true. A nickel worth a, ain't worth a dime anymore. Alright, get that and then go for the hoard. Could you be any louder? You trying to wake the dead? Yep. I'm trying to. Alright, take this and then we're good. Everything is for sale. $22. Alright, looks like everyone wants in. Come on in. One, two, oh, missed. Sorry that you're a traitor, sorry that you're zombies is, well, you're filled with zombies now, but it's okay, I'll clear them out. I'll make sure they don't get to you. Okay, that's a uh, good stuff. Get away from him. I'm here to trade, and I don't want any disturbing. Anything disturbing him. Cold again. I'm just spending a lot of my time at this trader. Looking for something special? Nope. Just selling you more goods. Alright, looks like uh, the horde is going to have to wait another day because I'm freezing. That barely didn't even level me up. I think I'm just going to spend the last uh, rank on Treasure Hunter because I just want to... Uh, I just want to have... Uh, just uh, really good chances of finding the treasures because... Usually for treasure hunting, there is a lot of stuff you can find, so... That's why I want to try and just get maxed out Treasure Hunter. Okay, I, I'm not in the winter biome anymore, and I'm still freezing. So clearly, there's something going on here. Now, I do know when you're freezing, you get hungry from it. So, I don't mind that, because I could use the extra calories and one thing I would like to know is where is that treasure at that I'm going to right now okay now it's start I'm starting to warm up now it like takes a minute before it like starts to realize like oh you're not in this biome anymore so we'll start warming you up all right so let's see uh where these treasures are. Okay, peas. I'm gonna eat them because I'm probably pretty hungry. Yeah, 61% really does affect you. Alright, one is over here. Okay, now that's the one I've always been going to. Now, where is uh, this one? So, this way. Pretty far away. Because it's all the way down here. So, I don't remember, uh, toggle, okay, that's Taylor's. I'm gonna, I'm just gonna just remove that and just, uh, go for Ralph, Ralphie's. Oh, God, what's with the, the lag? Alright, take out this cheerleader. Miss that. Oh, got her. Alright, and finish her off with the sledge. Except that didn't kill her. That did. 
All right. All right, now it's time to go back home and just get everything all sorted out. Found a really big working stiff tool. It sucks that it won't uh, respawn, but at least that I was able to get some uh, decent loot from it. Like, I got a nail gun, which is a nice find. Don't have to go around and finding all the parts. Also got another hunting rifle. I would like to see uh, how good that is. And also another sniper rifle. So, that is very excellent. Nope, big boy. I do want to take out this big boy. Also, we got the sledgehammer schematic at the trader. So, that's more than okay. Even though we found like... I don't know, like, four or five, like, around, like, three or four sledgehammers at that working stiff tools for some strange reason. So that was pretty crazy. Of how much, uh, that there was. Like, just, like, if you can't find sledgehammers, just go to a big working stiff tools. You'll find them there. Going the wrong way. But I'm pretty surprised that I just basically... There was a trader right there. A third trader. Not too far away. Like, I'm actually pretty surprised that I didn't even see him. Like, I never saw it just when I was just going through it. Just... The population in the forest is just too dense. Right there is where I'm going to make a bridge to make a shortcut. So I don't have to go all the way around. And also this treasure is actually quite far away. I just want to head home, regroup, and then possibly go for it. I just have to kill quite a bit more zombies in order to get a uh, last rank of treasure hunter which is 24 points it's pretty darn expensive it's 42 points for all the ranks of treasure hunter which a total that's a total of seven levels so it really does add up maybe even just maybe when I get back home my garden will be done. There's a bear. There's a bear. That is a big bear. And the bear looks so much different than it did back in Alpha 15. They made it much more, like, more beast looking. Because that thing is ginormous. So, don't want to mess with him. I might wait till I have an AK till I fight him. Come on, make it up the hill. There we go. Don't take damage. I've done a pretty good job of getting my health back up just by taking a bunch of painkillers. I don't need to take it back down again. Would you look at that? Everything looks like it's grown. Yep, everything is grown. And I've not really done anything else. Okay, put that in there. I'll actually get this melting. Nope, I don't want that. I want to put wood in. Okay, there we go. Alright, uh, beer, do I have any room? I do. Forged steel, nails, don't have any room. 26 bullets. I don't have, like, literally any room for anything. Do I have any, uh, food other than... I guess I'm going to have to eat some meat stew. 
that improved my wellness by quite a bit. Alright, so... I'm gonna need, uh... Hmm. I do need to check what's in my bike again. More forged. There's my puffer coat I was trying to look for. Okay, put that in there. Like, I literally don't have any room for anything. Excuse me. Alright, one thing I do want to do... Uh, well, actually, I want to use the other nail gun the nail gun frame I have in here. See if that will repair it, even at all. Not really. I think I'll probably repair this, then sell it. But, uh, I'll assemble that. And just use this to get it fully repaired. Now I'll go from a like an early, early like a 320 nail gun to a 350. So nice. Got some more. Uh, I do have a pickaxe in here. Pistol, shotgun, receiver, pistol parts. I just don't want to get rid of this. I just don't want to make another one until I'm ready. Uh, okay, so that pickaxe is with me. This I can replace the receiver. Just repair that. Make a 197. So that's just shy of what I can make. Do I have any stone in here that I see? Doesn't look like it. I might have to mine some more stone. Pick that up. Got 28 coin, uh, corn from that. So yeah, I do have a bunch of treasure maps, so I'm gonna have to... Gonna have to do that. Potatoes, put them in here. Uh, potatoes, and take those 22 seeds. And I'm just gonna plant them all. Well, if I can. Excellent. I take this. Make two of these. And that'll be good. See, so yeah, I'm just going to plant all this corn just so I get an extra inventory out. I've got plenty of cement. And also, I need to make another blunderbuss because I am really low on supply. Well, really low on the blunderbuss uh, thing. Like, as you can see. I'm very unorganized. So unorganized. Okay, this I can scrap, because that's not even worth keeping. Can I make another blunderbuss? Or am I missing something? I'm missing... Iron. Iron. There we go. Crap that up. Put that in here. Got some glass. Time to melt that down. Yeah, just a lot of things. A lot of things uh, still left to do. I didn't even click a button. So, I don't get what happened there. Okay, I'm not clicking anything. And apparently it's just doing random stuff. Alright, then, I'm just going to call it an episode here. I think it's just been a little bit uh, shorter than uh, usual. But, uh, 
I just gotta go and resort everything. I'm just gonna mine for a little bit and hopefully just grab a bunch of stuff. So yeah, I'm just gonna go mining for a little bit and probably when I come back, this will probably look way better than it did before. So, but anyways, thanks for watching everyone. I will see you guys in the next video. Peace.